A very useful hint for negotiating well is planning for several negotiation options. Let's explain. Quite often, we start a negotiation with a single objective in mind, a unique option that we consider success. For example, in purchasing a car, usually we want that one. And we don't consider any other car as a valid option. In negotiating a job offer, we generally think about a certain salary as a condition to succeed, and nothing else. If, when negotiating a car or a salary, we think more broadly, we can find more than one option that we can consider success. In the case of the car purchase, before concluding, I want the Model X, year Y, color Z, with a given maximum price. Why not thinking about what you consider important in a car? Is it really just that model? Or characteristics such as motor power, design, maintenance costs? The color is just that one? What is more important, the year of manufacturing or the mileage? Having many options of car which fulfill your requirements will increase significantly your chances of making a successful negotiation. In the case of the job offer, is it just about the salary or benefits? such as work flexibility, are important as well. These items also have value. Are you considering them? Insisting in just one option can be tiresome, can reduce your chances of success, and can leave behind other options that could be good or even better than your first choice. Think about it when negotiating.